boom guys in this video as you can see we have the brand new v10s these are called the hidden potential and as you can see we have a garatina v10 we have the gelade v10 as well as the rotan v10 and these are available on famousgirl.com if you want to grab them link in the description uh but today we're going to open these up just kind of work out what are inside these being a tin uh we don't know what it's in what packs are inside these until we open them and i know you're probably watching this video to find that out so let's get into it i guess we're starting off with the garatina probably the most popular out of the three pokemon's promos here so let's go so boom as you can see four packs one promo and a code card as usual and you got a little uh, description there if you want to pause and read that uh, but yeah 12 packs in total to open very interesting to see what's inside i can imagine uh lost origin packs hopefully with the garrett we got like because all these promos here are like different artworks like as you can see this is a sword and shield promo of garatina so unique artwork not the same one from uh lost origin uh so sword shield number 259 and then the packs are lost origin lost origin and double fusion strike so two fusion strike two lost origins in a tin there so boom and did i give these codes out i'm going to give them out in my disc youtube membership um before the video goes live so join the youtube membership i'm going to give some of those exclusive codes out to you guys in the membership so let's get into this let's go come on let's see what we can get guys we can get some cool stuff out of the tins recently uh just in general like collection tins has not been bad uh, especially in our box breaks we've been opening these and stuff like that like different tins um and yeah collection tins always good just i don't get the good luck you guys seem to get the good luck so let's see we've got here macro lost vacuum and a comfy we'll put the comfy on the side you know comfy's a playable pokemon so go for a little bit on ebay um but come on let's go obviously we lost origin oh almost messed it up uh obviously we lost origin you got the old arts here aerodactyl and garatina which we still need for the collection so hopefully let's pull those guys um but let's go we've got more wow gumi gliger polywag and landorus so lost origin zero hits we have fusion strike and i think this is going to be it was a slept on set boxes we're way under retail right uh, but now with the sp on the gengar old arts really up in price obviously got the new old arts in here as well uh the celebi old art as well in this set i think it is going to be a classic right now and yeah um if we can pull any of them old arts i would be over the moon i really need espion old art i got the gengar i've got everything but espion and the rainbow mew i think uh so let's see if we can pull those today i really love the rainbow mew i just love mew in, in general that's the only mew i don't have from the set we got dragapult hollow though one hit here so we can see how many hits we're getting put in I see glitter guys I see glitter I see glitter I don't know what the rarity was if it's a rainbow if it's an old art I don't know yo I don't want to get gas I don't want to get gas it end up being a V Max I know it's going to be a V Max let's see guys it always happens to me I thought a regular V Max but a new V Max old art oh my god not the one I want not the one I want, but a Mew VMAX ult art out of these tins. A little bit left to right, but this is my second one in my collection now. Insane. How insane is that? We just pulled an ult art out of these tins, guys. Make sure to get them. Link in the description on my website. Uh, but, yo, I saw, like, the glitter there. I was hoping it was an Espeon, but um, it is a Mew VMAX, which is nice. But I really just want that Espeon right now. But, yo, we'll take it. And a rainbow Mew I need still. So glad to get at least a Mew ult art out of that one. Well, I am gas. I go into these openings. I never really get anything crazy, right, in the collection boxes. Um, and, yeah, there we go. First tin. Even the Garatina tin as well. That was pretty epic. Fusion Strike came with two hits. The two Lost Origins didn't. But, boom, Rotom tin here. Rotom V. You know, Rotom V is also in um, Lost Origin. So this is a different artwork to it. Um, Sword and Shield promo, same packs it should be with throughout all these tins here. And we'll just open these up, trying to see the poor rates. Imagine we can get more bangers. If so, these tins could be cracked. But yeah, definitely does treat sleep on Fusion Strike, especially with a lot of the uh, chase cards going up in price. Like for me, even. Ooh, that's four from the back. I think I felt texture on that one. Uh, but for me, like there's a lot of cards I'm still missing from Fusion Strike. So yeah, literally the only set where I'm missing some cards, but come on. Garatina V-Star. Yo, we'll take that. We take those for sure. Come on. Yeah, not quite a full art though. Um, but yeah, Garatina full oh, art I've actually pulled. Um, oh, this one seems to have a dirty error on the back. 
Um, hopefully it's not nothing crazy, but I, I wouldn't mind if I could pull one of the chase cards and it was damaged. Like I said, one is better than none. Um, so yeah, let's see what it is anyways. But boom, I just need the Aerodactyl Alt Art. Oh, Beautifly Hollow. And you got some dirty, like, factory floor on there. So yeah, I don't know about that one. I'll just put it on a separate pile here for now. All right, Fusion Strike. Fusion Strike did us well last time, but two hits from Lost Origin. There's going to be two hits on average per tin. Let's see, guys. Come on. Um, but boom. So last tin was two. And this tin, we had two hits from Lost Origin this time around. So Fusion Strike going to have anything. Okay, we've got Cinderace V. So three hits. So we've got a hit in every tin so far. Can we get one in that last one? So Cinderace V there. Boom. Okay, guys, come on, let's go. Let's see what we've got here. Come on, we need another hit. If we get one hit here, this tin has had a hit in every single pack. But Golem and the Oricorio, so three out of four there. And we move to the last tin, Jelade. What set is Jelade in in, um, in the main sets? Like, I can't remember what set it is in. Is it Astral or Lost Origin? Let me know down in the comments, guys. But, boom. So there we go, Jelade V promo. And code card, but they will probably be get scanned because I want to start giving the exclusive promo codes to my YouTube members. So if you want to support the YouTube membership, make sure to join the link in the description. But the same packs again, like I mentioned. And yeah, if we can get another old art, especially from Fusion Strike, can't lie, I want an old art from Lost Origin as well. I need that Aerodactyl bad. Um, but yeah, let's go. Come on, boom, and then let's go. First pack, Lost Origin. So yeah, guys, let me know how you're getting on. How you getting on with Fusion Strike? How you getting on with Lost Origin? Have you pulled your chase cards yet from either of those sets? But first, Lost Origin, nothing. Come on, second Lost Origin now. Come on, we need some good pull rates like that previous tin. If not, get a banger like the first tin. Uh, with the ORV Max, Ori makes the video worth it. I'm not even sure the value on that bad boy. So let me know down on the, in the uh, comments. What's the value on the v, uh, VMAX ORV Mew? Lost Origin with no hits there, but come on, hopefully Fusion Strike will save the day again. I can't lie. I think I see glitter on this bad boy. Am I gonna gas it up again, guys? Have I gassed it up again? Is it just gonna be the reverse tricking me? Or did I see glitter in the background, guys? Come on, Onyx, Simi Poor. What was glittering on the top? But it's still a hit, Greninja V. But yeah, I saw a little shimmer on the top and I thought we had like the Seeker X, obviously the VMAX Old Arts and the Rainbow Reds have the glitter texture to it. But boom, let's not spin it to the back, let's not spoil the pools, the code card, four from the back. There seems to be an error here. What the hell's gone on there? It's like, hold on, I'll put that there for now, but we'll, have, we'll inspect that shortly. But yeah, that's a weird error, but let's go. Sizzler piece, Starfall, Sandy Guest, Pulse. Electros and Electros, so boom, only one hit in that tin. But this poor Vulpix has like the blue layer peeling on there. I don't know if you can see it, but yo, absolutely insane pulls out of these tins. Not bad overall. What do you guys reckon? Uh, especially with a VMAX alt art layer. So yo, we'll take those. These tins are available on famouscroll.com, guys. If you want to get them, we have a limited stock available of these, but if they do well, we'll try and get some more in for you guys because the poor rates are crazy. Um, so guys, like, subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.